many times uh, are you here in Moldova in one year? In, I think I've been about 15 or 16 times since I first came. Uh, uh, last year I came twice, this year I'm coming twice. How is the movie going? The movie is really going very well in the UK. Uh, people really like it and uh, we're spreading the word. Now what we would like to do is for other countries to find out about it. And uh, uh, As far as I know it was launched uh, yes, uh, the previous year in Moldova. I've been to the, to the premiere and in UK. In what other countries do you want to promote the movie? Well, we have a, we have a Romanian uh, uh, translation, uh, subtitles, Russian subtitles. But I think it's possible in, in Italy, where there's a big Moldovan uh, community. In France, also, we showed my other film in France, it went very well. Uh, and obviously America would be fantastic, or Canada in the English-speaking countries, Australia. Yeah, that would be the best thing, yeah. Uh, if it's not a secret, how much money did you raise from distributing the movie? Well, so far we've raised about £80,000, um, which is paid for the, the first stage of building the new care centre. So now we need to raise the next stage to finish the, ne the second stage of the building. You wrote a book about Moldova, then you made a movie about Moldova. What's next? What are you going to do uh, in your next activity involving our country's name? I've no idea. I've no idea. I made a speech today in Moldova about suggesting how we could all manage ourselves differently in the world. So uh, maybe I'll be invited back to Moldova for something. That was my next question, actually. You, you, you spoke about new equality, yeah? Uh, is that possible in UK now? Uh, donating 50% from your uh, earnings? Well, I think it, it could be more than 50%, depends how much you earn. I, I, I believe, I personally believe that there is a point when having more money is, 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 is meaningless. So, there is research that shows when you reach a certain level of wealth, if you earn more on top of that, it doesn't make you any happier. You've been here so many times, you probably understood our society. Do you think that would be possible in Moldova with our mentality? I think it's absolutely vital for Moldova. It, this is a country where there are people with so little and, there, and then a, a huge car drives past, which to me is it's a recipe for disaster. Because if you, the, there is evidence out there, which I said in my speech, if you don't close that equality gap, you have social disharmony and you have crime and you have violence and unless you just crush it with an iron fist. So, Moldova will have to change.